Welcome back to chemistry. This is Jeremy Krug with another chemical reaction. This time I have a test tube set up here and I'm going to add just a few milliliters of hydrochloric acid. Hydrochloric acid. This particular acid has a concentration of six moles per liter, so it's pretty concentrated. Then I'm going to take a little piece of zinc metal. I have this zinc metal in my hand here, as you can see. Uh, it's pretty shiny, just like most metals are, kind of silvery in color. And I'm going to drop the zinc into the acid. Now those are uh, bubbles of hydrogen gas. I'm making quite a bit of hydrogen gas here, so I'm going to put this other test tube on top so I can collect as much of that hydrogen gas as possible. And since hydrogen is less dense than air, most of that hydrogen should stay in the test tube. If I touch this, I can feel that the test tube is getting very warm. In fact, it's quite hot. So this is an exothermic reaction. So I'm making quite a bit of, of hydrogen here. All those bubbles of hydrogen are being produced. Now, when I'm satisfied that I've made enough hydrogen gas, and I think I've made quite a bit, I will let this run a little bit longer. I think that's probably good enough. When, I've satisf when I'm satisfied that I've made enough hydrogen gas, I'm going to lower this. And... Come back to that later. Now I'm going to take that hydrogen that I've just collected and let's see what happens when I take this little flame and set the hydrogen on fire. Did you hear the pop? Now, this test tube is quite warm as well right at that spot. So this is an exothermic reaction too. And if you look closely, I bring this closer, perhaps you can see it, but inside, it's a little hard to see on the camera, but right inside this test tube there's a little bit of condensation, which tells us that that hydrogen burned, which means that it reacted with oxygen to form a little bit of water. And so it's a little hard to tell here, but we made a little bit of water. I hope you enjoyed this chemistry demonstration. Visit my website at www.krugslist.org for more chemistry tutorials and demos, and subscribe if you liked what you saw.